Alright guys, with Root enabled, if you try to play Pokemon Go, this is what you'll see. Go ahead and sign in. And you will see that your device is not supported. Alright, this is because I have a rooted phone. So let's go ahead and close out of this and go back to Magisk Manager. I'm going to go ahead and turn off Root Toggle. And it should now allow you to play the game fine. Alright, watch this and... Boom shakalaka, baby. Pokemon Go does not support rooted Android phones. But you know what? There's a simple work way around it. You can install this thing called Magisk. It will allow you to play Pokemon Go and even use Android Pay on any rooted Android device. Let's go ahead and take a look. Okay guys, installation. Okay guys, to install Magisk, I do recommend starting uh, fresh, so do back up everything before you begin. First thing you want to do uh, is download uh, these files you need. Also use an SD card if possible, if you have an SD card slot. Um, you will see, uh, you'll need SuperSU Magisk Zip, and also you'll need Magisk V6.zip, and also you'll need Magisk Manager.apk. Alright, go ahead and download all of those files uh, onto your phone. Next, we're going to go ahead and reboot into Twerp. Go ahead and power off your phone. Now, this will work on any Android device, but do make a backup ROM, backup all of your apps using Titanium Backup App, because uh, you'll probably lose everything. Sometimes it might not work on your phone uh, all for all these re reasons. But once it starts working, you should be good to go. Let's boot into Twerp. Volume up, center home, power for any Galaxy devices, uh, such as the Galaxy S7 Edge. I'm going to let go of the power button. It should enter you into twerp, all right? Similarly for other phones, you all right, Next, what you're gonna do is a wipe and do a factory reset. Again, this will erase everything on your phone. It won't erase contents or um, internal storage or anything like that, but it will erase all your apps and settings. All right, once that's done, we're gonna go ahead and install two files. Go ahead and go into install. Go ahead and select Magisk first, and also add more zips and select Super SU in that exact order, all right? And then you're gonna go ahead and swipe and this will install both of the files, reboot, uh, sign in through it again, and you will have uh, full root and also be able to run Pokemon Go. I'll root a phone. I'm gonna go ahead and reboot. I right, once booted, we're gonna go ahead and sign in. Alright, once signed in, you should now be able to play Pokemon Go uh, with the rooted phone. And let me go ahead and show you that I have a rooted phone here, Super SU. Go to Expert, and you'll see I don't get any errors. Let me go ahead and download Pokemon Go, uh, the latest version, and also Android Pay. Alright guys, next I'm going to go ahead and use ES File Explorer to install the Magisk Manager. So go ahead and install it. Install. Install. You may have to check on those sources on again. Go ahead and open it once installed. Now you will see root is enabled. All right, guys, with root enabled, if you try to play Pokemon Go, this is what you'll see. And you will see that your device is not supported. All right, this is because I have a rooted phone. So let's go ahead and close out of this and go back to Magisk Manager. I'm going to go ahead and turn off root toggle. All right, make sure you hit grant. Go ahead and try it again. And you'll see root not mounted and forcing. And now I'm going to go ahead and go into Pokemon Go. And it should now allow you to play the game fine. All right, watch this. And boom shakalaka, baby. And there you go. Now you can play Pokemon Go. Uh, this is the latest version. And I can prove to you that uh, I have the buddy. So this is version uh, 0.37.0. All right. And if you need to use root again, you can go ahead and simply toggle. Go ahead and use Magisk Manager and toggle this also. All right? You can also use this method to use Android Pay. That's pretty much it. Now you should be able to play Pokemon Go on the latest 0.37.0 and also use Android Pay uh, with a rooted device. Anyway, don't forget to thumbs up for me. Do try this out and do let me know that now you should be able to play Pokemon Go on a rooted device and even use Android Pay on your rooted Android device. Very good stuff. We actually killed two stones with one bird.
two birds with one stone. Have a great day, and as always, stay on and dry. Click here to subscribe.